Okay, welcome future year seven to the Le Canavé School PE department. I'm just going to take you through the team of PE staff who's going to be teaching you um, a little bit about why we're going to be teaching you PE. Some of the activities you're going to cover in year seven, the PE kit you're going to need, uh, extracurricular sports you can get involved in, and some inter-house activities as well for you. So lots to get through. So who are the team teaching PE at Le Canavé School? There's myself, Mr. Lefevre, I'm head of PE. Second in charge is Miss Moon. Mr. Jones is a PE teacher as well as being the head of year nine. We have Miss Lindsay, Mr. Heaven, and Mr. Cardwell. What are we gonna learn in physical education? So we are gonna to learn to develop uh, physical abilities such as our speed and strength and stamina. We are going to do lots of different skills and lots of different sports, so we're going to look to develop the current skills you have, and we're also going to look to learn fun new skills as well. As well as the physical side of things, P is fantastic for developing you mentally as well, so something such as cognitive functioning, what does that even mean? That means, that means our ability to develop your decision-making skills, your ability to think clearly and think quickly, that is all improved by doing physical activity. Your intellectual development, that's your ability to learn, so PE will actually help you become a better learner and it will help you across all your subjects. We'll look at developing you socially as well, your ability to work as part of a team, work cooperatively to help each other uh, to get to a successful goal. So there's lots of different benefits you're going to gain from physical education. So as you can see on the left hand side we've got lots of different physical activities which you're going to be taking part in year 7. You might have done some of these before in primary school or in clubs around the island. Uh, if you've never done these activities before, that's absolutely fine. Hopefully that's going to be exciting for you to try some new sports and new activities uh, with the main aim on each and every one of you trying hard and learning and improving as you go along. What PE kit are you going to require at Le Canavé School? Here is a list of all the items you're going to require. One thing which isn't on here is a swim cap. You all, all need a swim cap for well, obviously when you're doing swimming. When you start at Le Canavé School, you're probably thinking, what am I going to need? I'm going to have PE as one of my first lessons. What should I bring? I don't know what sports I'm doing. Those first lessons are going to be introductory lessons. Boys, we recommend you bring your navy beat PE polo shirt, your navy blue shorts, your navy blue football socks and your trainers. Girls, can you bring your navy PE polo shirt, your navy blue score, your navy blue football socks and your sports trainers as well. So as well as your normal PE lessons, you'll have two PE lessons a week. After school, we have extracurricular sports. There's lots of different sports for you to get involved in. We play, play against other schools on the island. We play in leagues and we play in cup competitions and tournaments. We also play against visiting school teams that will come to the island from the UK or from France and they're always a great test and, and exciting to play against new people which you may, may have not met before. Extracurricular sports take place after school and they will training will usually take place from 2.50 till 4 o'clock. Matches, finishing times vary depending on where we're playing and who we're playing. Um, but information about all training and all matches will be given out to students well in advance so you know where to go, when to go and what time you'll be back. Carrying on with the extracurricular sports themes, as you can see on the left hand side we've got lots of different teams for you to get involved in. We wear the Le Canavé School PE kit when we do this. Obviously with the badge and the players and that represent the school do so with pride and always give 100% effort. It would be great to see as many of you there as possible to these teams. You don't need to have played in a sports team before. You don't need to have played in primary school. You might be completely new to the sport. You're more than welcome to come along training. We're delighted to see new people and new faces turn up to training. So please get involved when these opportunities arise. As well as extracurricular sport, which takes place after school, we have the inter-house sport. This will take place sometimes in lesson time so we have lots of different inter-house events which make up the whole inter-house calendar these are the specific sports events you can get involved in we've obviously got the three houses McKeon who wear red Watts who wear yellow and Tranta who wear blue and these are always really keenly contested and competitive occasions 
culminating in the sports day at the end of the academic year which is a great opportunity for people to compete uh, and also a great opportunity for people to come out and support their houses as well so lots of different inter-house sports so finally year six soon to be year seven we're looking forward to seeing you in september stay safe stay active and that's goodbye from the p department and we'll see you soon